What's up my dudes? Merry Christmas, happy holidays, and all that good stuff. Welcome back to the channel. Today, uh, we got a special one for you. We are going to announce the winner of the 500 subscriber giveaway. I'm gonna show you what's going to be sent to you. And also, we're gonna open up some very awesome Christmas-themed M2 machines. But first, uh, I want to announce that uh, it is Red Room Diecast. You are the winner. Uh, it was totally random. I just had my girlfriend pick one totally at random, and uh, you're the lucky winner. But not only that, I did like your comment. You've been around with the channel a, a very long time, so I'm super stoked it's going to you. We are going to have more giveaways at 750 and then another one, a big giveaway, at 1000 So uh, thanks again to Red Room Diecast. This is what you've won in no particular order. Let's see, we got a, a 2019 Silverado Trail Boss. We got the 96 Impala SS. We have a GTR from the then and now set. Also got a McLaren P1. We got a premium Fast and Furious BMW M3. Uh, the Ever Classic 67 Camaro. And this a Land Rover Defender 90, one of my favorite castings of all time. So all this is yours. Just leave me um, uh, a comment with your P.O. box or whatever in the comment section on either this video or the last video. Either way, I'll see it. Uh, I'll write it down and delete it immediately, and I'll get this sent out to you with tracking. But all right, so uh, that was that. Now let's get into the cracking party. We're going to start with that one I just showed you. This awesome 85 Camaro IROC Z with the Coca-Cola tampos and the big Coke bottle up top. And of course, I forgot my scissors, so I'll be right back. All right, here we go. The package is now cut open. Let's go ahead and take it out. And there it is inside the jewel case. Very good looking. It's got some snowflakes on there that I did not notice before. So it's ice cold. It's got some green and red on there. And now, of course, I'll bust out the, our trusty screwdriver and we'll take this off of the base. And here it is. Look how cool that is. Look at those wheels. Those are really nice. They're black, so I was having a hard time seeing them until right now. And they are super cool looking. Very nice. Have a Coke and a smile. Also notice it has this big old cowl. That's where the Coca-Cola logo is. Coke bottle looks really nice too. They did a good job. Tail lights look pretty good. This one's a little bit off. But overall, yeah, very nice. Let's see if the hood opens. Oh, it does, cool. Nice, just all black, but it looks pretty cool. Oh, wow. Neat. Yeah, this is a really cool one. Definitely love my third gen Camaros. Very, very nice. Awesome. All right, let's move that packaging out of the way. Right, next one up, we have a Fox body. We went from the Camaro to the uh, Mustang. And uh, this one looks really nice. This is actually the first one in this set that I found. All right, once again, here it is in the Lexan case. Looks very nice. Love that it has that Christmas tree on top there. How cool is that? But uh, yeah, once again, let me just go ahead and crack this one free and I'll be right back. And here it is. How awesome is that? Coke is it. <laughs> A little bit suggestive to my older crowd. There we go. Tell it's okay. You can see the pegs in this one, like really bad. Got a little, little piece right there. So I'm guessing there's, yeah, only this rivet up front. And then there's these two. Look like that wing is about to fall off. We got more pegs on the headlights too. And there's a little gap in the hood and the headlights are not really on that well. Can you see that okay? Did not notice that when I bought it. I imagine it's pretty hard to line those up perfectly, but that's kind of a bummer. Let's see if the hood opens. Yep, looks like it does. See the five liter in there? Pretty cool. Even the Ford Mustang is kind of messed up too. Only half of it seems to be there and it doesn't really close quite right. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's okay. Oh. oh, I see a little rubber band here. I guess this thing's supposed to come off, but I'm gonna leave it. I'm going to leave it because I really like that Christmas tree just chilling on top. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, so there's that one right there. The opposing forces of the Camaro and Mustang. Let's see, now let's do some square bodies. Let's 
see. I don't, I've been wanting to crack this one open for a minute now. Check this one out. We've got a 75 GMC Sierra Grande 15, which is one of my favorite trucks of all time with the big Coke bottle in the back. Oh, I haven't been mentioning like the limitedness of these. Uh, looks like there's about 9,600 of the other ones and then 9,250 of this one. So not super limited. Uh, and also these were a bit more expensive than your average uh, vehicles. They're about $9 each, which is kind of a lot when you find them on the peg. Uh, but I think they're well worth it, especially the square bodies. But let me just bust out the scissors and I will return in a sec. Here we go. One more square body for the collection. <laughs> How cool. Love this one. Oh, look at that awesome bright white interior. Ha, <laughs> Coke adds life to having fun. What an interesting logo there. And again, a little bit suggestive by calling it Coke and not Coca-Cola. Uh, red and white, very nice. Some thin white wall tires and some very realistic rims. Slammed, of course, because that's how I like my trucks. Metal on metal, as always. Oh, that looks nice. GMC on the back looks really clean. Tail lights are pretty decent. Let's check out those headlights and grill. Oh, it's gold. I didn't even notice that. And the GMC is pretty legible, a little crooked, but not bad. Let's check out that engine. Yeah, pretty typical fare, but it looks nice. This is such a cool truck. You gotta love it. My girlfriend was a huge fan of these. She was stoked that I was able to find these. Very, very cool. She she loves Christmas. She loves Coca-Cola. I mean, who doesn't? And uh, yeah, she was stoked. And you know what I was just thinking? I cannot believe it's already been a year. Uh, my last year Christmas video was, was way more special than this one. This one's cool. I like this one for sure. But last year I opened up a bunch of fairly rare RLC cars. You should check that one out if you haven't already. And next up we got... The very last one of the video, 73 Cheyenne Super 10. Awesome. So cool. This one doesn't look as slammed. Looks like it might be lowered a little bit or no, no, it might just be stock height. Either way, it looks really nice. I will crack it open and be right back. Ta-da! Here it is. Green, white, and red. Beautifully Christmas themed. Got the Christmas tree in the back, which I love. And apparently, yeah, it's removable. It's just on here with this little rubber band, which it sucks for the paint right there, but it does keep the tree on there pretty nice. So we'll see what I do with that in the future, but for now we will leave it on. 90 years of Coca-Cola and Santa. More realistic rims. Nice tires, love that tread. M2 does a great job, metal on metal of course. And let's see here. Same engine looks like. Beautiful grill work and headlights. Very, very nice. I love their grills. They do such a good job with the grills and the bumpers. They just look so legit. I might be missing the tailgate handle on that one. Do they come with tailgate handle? Well, maybe not. I mean, that's just how they come. No biggie. This thing is so awesome. This time we got a black interior. No, they put side view mirrors on both the cars, but neither of the trucks. I wonder why they do that. I mean, I think they know that we're going to buy the trucks regardless. That's probably why. <laughs> but wow, I just love this one. So awesome. All right, you guys, that was the video. Uh, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me on this Christmas afternoon. If you are new to my channel, my name is J-Dog, and I post videos about two or three times a week. And uh, also, once again... Uh, Red Room Diecast, you are the winner of the giveaway. Just let me know your address in some way, shape, or form, and I will send uh, all those cars out to you as soon as the post office is back open, of course. And uh, yeah, another giveaway at 750 and another huge giveaway at 1000. I do really want to get to 1000. I want to be able to go live and hang with you guys in real time. And uh, yeah, thanks again for watching, and we'll catch you dudes next time.